Brandy Davison here. I am a design team member with the Wild Hair Kits and I'm super excited today to walk you through my October kit. Um, for this month, each of us design team members are working with the Petite Kit. Um, it's a really great way uh, with the Petite size to get a little bit less product for a little bit less of a price point and really use it as a way to re-energize your own stash. So what you do is you get this smaller kit and then it gives you that opportunity to bring in those pieces that are from your stash. So you're not hoarding, but you're still getting new stuff and it's kind of the best of all the world. So I'm really excited. Um, don't don't be scared though, or don't be worried about this, the word petite. It does not mean petite. You will see here how much product I got this month. It's just absolutely fabulous. It is less, but it still feels like such an amazing present from your scrapbooking bestie in the mail, this hand curated kit. So I have been, um, this term with my design team, I have been asking for a color inspired kit each month. And this kit I asked for, a kit inspired by green. So I filled up my style profile with all the things I love and hate, the things I wanna see in my mailbox and don't, from colors to cardstock to embellies. Um, and in my what project are you working on, I specifically said that I wanted to be working on stuff that went with green for a green inspired kit. And as you can probably glimpse, I got what I asked for. Surprise, surprise, that's the whole point of the wild hair kit. So. When you fill in your style profile, make it really specific to you, be you, and that is what you will get. It is so much fun. So without further ado, here is what I got for October. So the note that you get on your invoice, invoice, which is always fun, says to me, we hope you love all the lush greens this month from Pink Paisley and One Can You Too. I know I will. We also had to send a specialty paper from Chamel's latest collection because, because we know you've been swooning over it. Enjoy. I am totally busted. I have been swooning and making all kinds of hard eyes and comments on, on social media when some of the design team members got the specialty paper last month. So the Allison and the hand curating crew are definitely paying attention. So um, when when they ask you in your style profile for any of your social media accounts, do, do post them there because they do take a look and see what you're sort of into and what you've been commenting on and what you've been posting to really get a good idea of your style. So here we go. So from the Pink Paisley Truly Grateful Collection, this is the Ephemera pack. It comes with 40 pieces. So you can see it comes with two different packs. So these are like the smaller ones. And then quite a few really big ones if you kind of look at the size there. And I'll just flip this over so that you can really get a good idea of what's in there without having to hear me opening all the packages. So I definitely see great green in here, but all the colors of the rainbow, very classic for any Paige Evans um, collection. She just has a way of bringing the rainbow into everything. But I also see there's some great um, rose gold, gold foiled words in there which are going to be fun some phrase stickers and i love these little trees i've been absolutely paying attention to folks who've been playing with those trees on social media so that's going to be fun to get my chance to do it too so that's great also from the truly grateful collection pink paisley is 49 stickers so these are th uh thickers Ugh. these are puffy stickers apologies if you can hear my voice i have a cold it's also impacting my brain it seems these are super cute like seriously who doesn't need a puffy sticker of a chicken Everyone does. Um, and I love the little dots that can serve as enamel dots. And lots of these are just small enough to kind of create that sort of confetti type embellishment design on the page. So I'm really excited about these. And I love the greens infused throughout. I also received, I'll go to that in a sec, the Willow One Canoe 2. This is 76 stickers from the collection. And I really hope it's coming through the gold, pink, rose gold foiling that's in this kit. It's so great. The sayings are wonderful. Be kind, find joy in the ordinary. Love, I'm so into crosses right now, which can also be kisses or X's, which is very fun. And this is the other side. And I have to tell you, any sticker collection that has phrases in it is perfect. I love phrases on my pages. Absolutely, I'm addicted. This makes me very happy. So it'll be interesting to see, and quite the mix from potted plants to butterflies to florals to a pencil to another pencil, which says simple pleasures and full of joy. So I'm sure I have a couple of pictures of me journaling or reading, which will be really fun. So love that. Okay, also included in each kit you probably saw there and have seen with other unboxing is the thank you card, which is great. And it's just a really good reminder that if you're creating something using a wild hair kits, please do um, give us a tag at the wild hair kits or use the hashtag the wild hair kits or both. Um, we love to see what people are creating with the kids and with the kits and often um, find inspiration from you guys and what you're doing and love to make comments on the great work that you guys are doing. So always, always inspiring for us as well. And this one says, happy, hi Brandy, happy October crafting from Allison. Fabulous. So included in the kit is, for me, is the petite kit is the um, die cut. And I'm just going to flip this. Oh, I love that pink. 
Um, you get the die cut in the deluxe. You have to ask for it in the petite, but you get access to the cut file, digital files. Hold on. If you do get a petite kit and you want the cut file, do feel free to ask for it because Allison will include it. Um, but if you have your own cut file machine, you can do, you have access. Once you order a kit, you'll have access to the file and you can cut it any old size that you want. So that's really fun. All right. So that's pretty cool. I'm excited to use that. Enjoy today goes perfectly with this kit, like be kind and slow down and all that good stuff. So onto the paper. So this is the Pink Paisley Truly Grateful number 11. Totally green inspired. Love it. Love all these little houses. So fun to fussy cut. Even just with some gesso in here to kind of tone it down a little and then pile some stuff on top would be super fun. But I have to tell you, I love this pink side. I love that it's kind of got a bit of a watercolor look to it. It's not an even pink. And I love that these dots aren't perfect. That they are just kind of, they're just great. They look sketched. I love this pink paper. Next up is the Pink Paisley Truly Grateful number five paper. Love this green. And I'm absolutely super into botanicals right now. I cannot wait. I already, oh, I want to fussy cut these and layer them about. I think this is super fun. The touch of color in the butterflies is just perfect. So this is really great. Love it, love it. I love this blue side. Oh, I'm such a blue girl. Green is actually hard for me to use. This is sort of a challenge month for me, for myself. Even though I love the color green, I just find I don't scrapbook with it. So it's going to be hard for me to not use this blue and really focus on this green side. So we'll see. We'll see how I do. We'll see. Either way, it'll be gorgeous because it's fabulous paper. I love tone on tone and I love brush script. This is absolutely gorgeous and I love that it fits the whole theme like let go, rest easy, be still, drift, simple pleasures. This is just absolutely great. I, uh, I can absolutely see myself using this in many, many ways. And isn't that a fabulous branding strip? Well done. And this is um, One Canoe Two from the Willow Collection. Ambrose Floral, it's called. And this is actually great as well. That peach just really pops off. This would be great to fussy cut and layer. Oh, and it would look so good layered on here. I wonder if there's a way I could kind of bring the A and the B side together. It's really hard when the A and the B side are both fabulous. Oh my, this is gorgeous. This is one Canoe 2 Willow called Lush. Love, love, love this. This is just, oh, I like this too. That's such a good green. I love this type of pattern, that kind of messy geo, like not a perfect geo. It looks a little bit sketch. You can see some are thicker and some are thinner than others where the lines are. Love that. Great branding strip again. Wow, branding strips for the win on this on this petite kit this month. But I do love this side. It would be great to kind of fussy cut in here but keep it all together and kind of have it out the side of the page with, you know, some pieces kind of tucked in and oh, this is going to be fun. I'm really excited about that. Um, and here is the Dear Lizzie, She's Magic, Feeling Fine, love it. Love the bits of green in here, that's gonna be really great and would really pop if you had some more green kind of as a layering here. Um, really like the saying that's that's on here, these are great, adventurous, exciting, my happy place. You could do so much with this and I love the colors. The fact that they're full rainbow as well, it's gonna go so great with those truly grateful pieces from Paige Evans, um, Pink Paisley, I think that's gonna be great. Oh, and this yellow side. It's like a yellow-orange kind of toned down gold color almost. And that watercolor look is just so gorgeous. Again, another fabulous branding strip. Love it. Love it, love it. So this is the Chamel specialty paper from the Field Trip collection that I am totally busted for swooning over on social media. And I'm so glad I swooned because now I have my own piece. And this is so much fun so it is a um, die cut cardstock so each of these pieces can pop out it's that graph background um i just absolutely love it heather from heather's crafty life got it last month and i was so excited to see what she would do with it because she just has a great style and oh now i'm so glad i have it too so i'm really pumped um i could see myself color blocking with this i yeah there's so many options uh, yeah this is just absolutely fabulous i'm really excited to have this so there you go. That is my petite kit for October, inspired by the color green. I feel like it's like a Sesame Street ending when I say that. Um, here we go. These are all of the goodies that I received this month. Thank you so much for watching. Um, you'll definitely see what I create with this on my social media accounts at Brandy, State, at Brandy Davison 
as well as on the Wild Hair Kit social media accounts. And by all means, each of us design team members, most of us have a YouTube channel that we're sharing our unboxing. I'll link to some more of those below because I enjoy enabler videos. So happy to provide those to you as well. Um, and as well throughout the month, you'll see what things we're creating. So thank you. And again, if you've ordered a kit, please, please, please tag us at the Wild Hair Kits or hashtag the Wild Hair Kits. We'd love to see what you make. Have a fabulous October. Thank you.